Now, yes, they have different plugins like the Waves Vocal Writer and stuff, but that using a plugin like that is basically saying that you don't trust your ears enough to uh, control the level of the vocal when you could really do it a, a, a whole lot better than that plugin can do, right? It's kind of guessing on controlling the the. I'm also a big fan of multiband compression, right? Because it's just like we kind of thinking about looking at the individual pieces of a clip, how one section could be too loud. Well, frequencies can be the same way. So maybe the whole overall signal isn't too loud, but maybe sometimes, you know, it just gets a little harsh in the 2K or is there's a little bit of boominess down in the 400 range. Whenever that happens on occasion, I don't want to just scoop those out altogether, but allowing you to use multiband compression to control those frequency bands, it just uh, gives my uh, vocal or whatever it is that I'm mixing a lot more uh, natural characteristics as we going on. So